Hi, I'm Gail and welcome back to LowCarbRecipeIdeas.com. Today we're going to do a recipe that came from Family Friends Fat Burning Meals. Um, it's by Diana Koulian. I'm not even sure if I say her name right. But she has some awesome recipes, really healthy, healthy recipes. The last one that I just completed was um, an awesome crispy orange chicken, which we're going to put on the the new recipe we're going to do today and today it's going to be a low carb um, fried rice a healthy fried rice and it's really good together so let's get started and I'll show you how to make this fried rice so I'm going to do my video a little bit different I'm kind of displaying what I've got because I've prepared everything ahead of time so we've got um, our shredded cauliflower we've got salt and pepper we have our carrots and our peas and actually I have beans in here um, in the recipe it's only supposed to be carrot and peas but I took frozen ones out of a bag um, and there's no corn in it then I have soy sauce but instead of soy sauce in her recipe she is wanting us to use coconut aminos and that's I haven't been able to find it so I'm using this soy sauce in its place and it's one carb per one tablespoon and then three eggs and some oil so now we're going to go to the stove and we're going to put it together. I have two tablespoons of olive oil. I'm going to use my spatula here. And I'm going to put it on medium high heat. Now with my, my um, vegetables, I used a frozen bag and I'm using two and a half cups of frozen vegetables here. Now what I've done was I already boiled them to get them thawed out and now I'm going to fry them in the frying pan. With her recipe you should be using one and a half cups of carrots, boil them till they're tender and then um, a cup of peas. So now we're just going to fry these up, heat these up just a little bit And then we're going to add three eggs. Just like you get when you go to a Chinese restaurant. And we'll stir these up. I find if you let it sit for a second or two and then move them up, just like when you're doing scrambled eggs you'll get the little pieces of egg through the vegetables. Once you have the egg looking like it's scrambled, we are now going to add the cauliflower. And what I did was I took my cauliflower and I put it in the, the food processor and shredded it. So that's one whole cauliflower. So we're just going to stir this all up. Now we're going to add three tablespoons of soy sauce. Now it was supposed to be coconut aminos, but I don't have any and I haven't been able to find it. So I'm going to keep hunting around without having to buy it online. It's got to have it at a health food store or something. I just haven't been in looking recently, you know. So we'll see how this turns out. We're going to add some salt and pepper for taste. And then I'm going to put the lid on, cover it for about five minutes, and let it cook up on low heat. Now I'm going to add another tablespoon of the soy sauce to give it a little extra flavor and we're all ready to go. Nice tasty fried rice, healthy fried rice. So this is my stir-fried healthy rice and it is also from the family friends fat burning meals. quite nice. This is the healthy fried rice by family friends
Fat Burning Meals, um, Diane Coulian. She um, has some awesome recipes in her books. And if you go on my site, lowcarbrecipeideas.com, you will see the book on the right-hand side. You can click on that and you can just read all the information concerning what she has to offer in her recipe books and using all healthy foods to make her recipes. Well, I hope you try this recipe and try my other recipes on lowcarbrecipeideas.com and we'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye now.